Hi guys, in this video we are going to learn the three important things should be remembered while doing physics exam. Are you struggling with physics? This is the video you should watch. If you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe. Let's go through the points. The first thing, don't try to do 50 MCQs within that two hours. Why is that? If you are aiming to score a pass for the physics, it's enough if you get above the 35 corrects in MCQs. If you can do the 50 MCQs within that time, no problem, you can do it. But if you have, if you are an average person and you don't have enough time to complete that 50 MCQs within that time, then don't try to do it faster because if you solve these problems faster, you can make higher number of careless mistakes, which will reduce your marks. So try to do 40 MCQs or 42 MCQs within that two hours, but make sure you don't make any careless mistake. That means when you are doing that 42 MCQs, you already know those steps and you already know that answers then you can score above 35. No issues with that. So try to minimize your careless mistake. That's the main thing I'm going to advise you. The next thing, the structure question answering methods. When you are answering structure questions, you should be careful. Why is that? The answer scheme for the structure question will include some important points. When you are writing an answer for that structure question, you should give that point. Otherwise, you will lose the marks. So when you are studying the structure questions, just go through the past papers and just remember those points. What is the main point? If you lost that word, the key point, you won't get the marks. So if they are asking two or three methods, you can give up to four methods. But the main disadvantage by giving more points is you will lose your time to do the part two essay part. So make sure you should practice daily to write the answers faster in structure questions. Also, you should include the main points in every questions. The last part Allocate five minutes to read the essay question. Before selecting the essay questions, please read all the essay questions and select it. Most of the students try to select the essay questions. He will already planned, pre-planned about what will the essay question will come, what they will take. So in that manner, most of the students will go to the exam and first try the mechanics question or heat question or any question they have already pre-planned before the exam. So don't make that mistake. Just allocate five minutes. They will give you 10 minutes to read the essay paper. So just allocate the five minutes and read all the essay question. Then find what are the essay questions seems to be easy for you. After that, you just select the essay questions. Otherwise, you will lose the time and you will also lose the marks. So don't be hurry. Just read the essay questions and select the essay question what you are going to do. I hope this video would be useful for you. If you would like to join our family, don't forget to subscribe it. Thank you.